Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you liked this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in. That means well. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you all. And welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is alleged. Some is not. And the FAIR Act use is in my description box, y'all. So let's get to it, y'all. Let's get to it. First, I want to say happy Sunday. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Please stay safe and all that good stuff. Please stay aware of your surroundings. And please, y'all, watch the company that you keep. Because it just may save your life and keep you out of trouble. Okay, y'all? So, let's get to it. Let's get to it. Y'all, I had to put this story up right here. Because, brothers, y'all got to start being more careful than this. This just don't even make sense. Um, Y'all... Bobby Smurda just posted up, you know, I guess his, something that happened with him. Okay, y'all? Um, he ran into these random two women, and they acted like they were big fans of him, and they were so crazy about him, and this and that and that and this. And I guess he took them home with them, y'all. And he ended up having to kick them out of his house, because after he spent some time with them the next morning... They wanted to charge him for their time, y'all, okay? Um, brothers, y'all better start being careful. If I would have looked at these two, there's no way that they would have went home with me if I was a guy. I'm just going to put it out there. Look at, the, look, look at the back doors, y'all. Look at the back doors. Anybody that'll do this to themselves, it's something wrong in itself, okay, y'all? I'm so sick of looking at people that just overdo it with these surgeries. This is ridiculous. Now, we see that they're driving a nice car. So maybe this is why he thought that they wasn't after his money or this and that and that and this. But how he think they probably got this nice car, y'all? I'm just saying. Um, This is what he posted up. He says at 10 a.m., they trying to hit a lick. This is what he said. What the F is going on in Miami? MF's trying to sell Cootie Cat. Early in the morning, this is what he said. Attention to all the broke girls in Miami. We buy buildings, not cootie cat. Okay, I'm about to go back to New York to buy some more buildings. <laughs> Y'all, did they ever around and find out that he didn't need to, you know, purchase something from them? Y'all, now I just, I, you know, what puzzles me this day and age that. You're taking people back home with you. You don't know like this. And then it's two of them, okay? They can run all kind of gameplay, all kind of, you know, power moves. They can call somebody to come and take you out while they at your house. Like, it's so many things that can go wrong with bringing home two women at the same time. They're random women that you don't know, okay? And apparently, he was listening to what they said when he ran it to them because... He brought them home with them. And they thought that they just had, they got them a nice one, y'all. This is what they thought. And he, they all, he started recording them. Now, apparently it looked like more than him was at the house, which is a good thing, hopefully, that they were there too. But I see a guy right here to the right and then there's somebody recording. So I don't know if that's him. And he had somebody there as well, which is a good thing that somebody else was at the house with him at the time that he called himself bringing home some random stragglers. Uh, Y'all, be careful out here. Please be careful. This could have went wrong in so many levels. And a lot of times when um, somebody want to come at these guys now, especially these rappers, they're using women to do this. They're using women. Seriously. And I hope that he was recording while they were in the house. Because they could easily leave that house. And they can go and say he did something to them. So I just hope that, you know, our rappers and people start getting some sense, okay? Stop letting people know where you live and bringing them home with you. If you go, you know, get to know somebody, get to know them first before bringing them home with you, you know, just randomly that you meet on the street. These women were making him think. And y'all, look at this. Just look at this. They stay on the table. They stay on the plastic surgery table. Look at this. Both of them look like it's about to explode. 
who wants to be around here? And right on the street is there's some smell to this when they get this stuff put in there like that. And just they say they, they got a smell to them. I don't know. I don't be around nobody like this. But this is ridiculous. It's okay. If you're going to go get a little work done, fine. But this right here looks like it's about to explode. Okay, y'all? This is ridiculous. Okay? And they made him think that they were such big fans of his. And he brought them home. Y'all got to stop doing this mess. You really do. But I guess he think he got the last laugh. But just hopefully they don't go and try to, you know, press some charges on him and say he did this and that and that and this. Now, the good thing is he recorded them and he also recorded her smiling when she was going back to the car. So that's a good thing right there because she's laughing because they didn't get anything out of him. And they got the camera on them and they probably was going to come with some BS. But I'm happy that he was recording the whole incident and what happened. Brothers, brothers, brothers. I know y'all like <laughs> And big back doors, but is it worth this? Is it worth bringing somebody home and they lie on you? Is it worth bringing somebody home that you got to kick out? Don't bring them to your house. Don't bring pe just random people to your house like that. It just don't make any sense. And eventually, you know, your luck going to run out when you keep on bringing random people in there like this because then you're going to start getting charges brought up against you. And I'm hoping that just like they got cameras on the outside of the house, Hopefully, they have cameras on the inside of their house, too, so people can't just walk away and lie. Because you, you see what happened with Chris Brown. And Chris Brown, you know, they call themselves going to take him to court, you know, and get some money out of him. Chris Brown came with the receipts, okay, y'all? And they threw that case right out the door. But these are the type of people that do these type of things and come for these artists because they know they got money. Okay, y'all? And then some of them, they, they know that they, I'm just saying, y'all, they know that they like them big back doors. This is just overdoing it right here. If you're going to like big back doors, get something natural or get something that looks decent, not this mess right here. This is ridiculous. You can hit this and it can bust open and they can blame you for something. You know what I'm saying, y'all? And it could be a bad surgery, just just one hit away from just kaboom. And you mess around and be the one that hit it and it could go kaboom. And then you're going to be paying for surgery and if they don't pass away from it. Because a lot of these women with these BBLs, they're passing away because they got too much in there in the first place. And they can say what they want once you get there. And they leave. They can say whatever it is they want. So I'm hoping... That people are out here being careful. This is why I be saying all the time, y'all watch the company that you keep. He's laughing now. But every incident is not going to have, you know, your happy ending. Okay? It's not. And they got to start waking up before they get to the point where um, it's not a happy ending. And then that laugh, that laugh turns into a frown. I'm just saying, y'all. But anyway, um... Just want to let y'all know what Bobby Smurdo is up to, okay? I guess he's trying to prove that he, like, you know, he don't swing that route, too, because a lot of people have been saying he's been acting a little bit funny since he came home and this and that and that and acting a little strange. So, I guess maybe this is what he needed to prove to everybody that, you know, he's into women and this and that and that and this. But this looks artificial right here. I'm just going to say it, y'all. This looks so ridiculous. It doesn't make sense. I wouldn't even want to be seen bringing nobody home like this unless and they were just sitting around getting wasted and laughing at this, okay? Can you imagine this walking through your house and you just, and you and your boys just toe up in there and looking at this? They, they, I'm just saying, y'all, people that I know will be rolling up. They'll be laughing so hard at this, the guys. They'll be laughing hard and joking on them. So, y'all, you're not going to always get the last laugh. Be careful bringing people to your house like this, okay? Anyway, please like, share, and subscribe if you like the video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.